The Arabah Arabic, Wadi Arbt Wadi Araba, or Arava, Arava, Hebrew, Haraba Harava, lit. Desolate and dry area, as it is known by its respective Arabic and Hebrew names, is a geographic area south of the Dead Sea Basin, which forms part of the border between Israel to the west and Jordan to the east. The old meaning, which was in use up to the early 20th century, covered almost the entire length of what today is called the Jordan Rift Valley, running in a north-south orientation between the southern end of the Sea of Galilee and the northern tip of the Gulf of Aqaba at Aqaba, Eilat. This included the Jordan River Valley between the Sea of Galilee and the Dead Sea, the Dead Sea itself, and what today is commonly called the Arava Valley. The contemporary use of the term is restricted to this southern section alone. Topic: Geography. The Araba is 166 kilometers (103 miles) in length from the Gulf of Aqaba to the southern shore of the Dead Sea. Topographically, the region is divided into three sections. From the Gulf of Aqaba northward, the land gradually rises over a distance of 77 kilometers (48 miles) and reaches a height of 230 meters (750 feet) above sea level, which represents the watershed divide between the Dead Sea and the Red Sea. From this crest, the land slopes gently northward over the next 74 kilometers (46 miles) to a point 15 kilometers (9.3 miles) south of the Dead Sea. In the last section, the Arabah drops steeply to the Dead Sea, which is 417 meters (1368 feet) below sea level. The Arabah is scenic with colorful cliffs and sharp-topped mountains. The southern Arabah is hot and dry and virtually without rain. Topic: <inaudible> Flora and Fauna. There are numerous species of flora and fauna in the Arava Valley. Notably the Karakal, Karakal, Karakal is found on the valley savanna areas. History In biblical times, the Arava was a center of copper production. King Solomon is believed to have had mines here based on copper mines dating to his reign. The Arabah, especially its eastern part, was part of the realm of the Edomites called Idumeans during the Roman times. Later the eastern Arabah became the domain of the Nabataeans, the builders of the city of Petra. The Israel-Jordan Peace Treaty was signed in the Arava on October 26, 1994. The governments of Jordan and Israel are promoting development of the region. There is a plan to bring sea water from the Red Sea to the Dead Sea through a canal, Red Dead Sea's canal which follows along the Arabah. This long -envisioned project was once an issue of dispute between Jordan and Israel, but it was recently agreed that the project shall be constructed on and by the Jordanian side. <laughs> Demography In 2004, the Jordanian administrative district of Wadi Araba had a population of 6,775. Five major tribes comprise eight settlements on the Jordanian side, al Sidian, al Sidian al Ahaywat, al Ahaywat al Amarin, al Marin al Rashida, al Rashait, and al Azazme, al Zipt, as well as smaller tribes of the al Osefat, al Sifat al Ravife, al Rvifat al Manaja, al Mnat, and al Marzaka, al Mursked, among others. The main economic activities for these Arabah residents revolve around herding sheep, agriculture, handicrafts, and the Jordanian army. <laughs> Landmarks Timna Valley Park is notable for its prehistoric rock carvings, some of the oldest copper mines in the world, and a convoluted cliff called King Solomon's Pillars. On the Jordanian side is the famous Wadi Rum, which is famous among rock climbers, hikers, campers, and lovers of the outdoors. Also in Jordan is the copper mining area of Wadi Finan, including the site of Kirbat and Nahas, corresponding to the one from Timna Valley in the west. Finan Ecolodge was opened in Wadi Finan by the Royal Society for the Conservation of Nature in 2005. Jordanian localities Below is a list of Jordanian population clusters in Wadi Araba 
The total Jordanian population in the region is 103,000, of whom 96,000 live in Aqaba. Israeli localities Below is a list of Israeli localities in the Arava, from north to south. The Israeli population of the region is 52,000, of whom 47,500 live in Eilat, and just over 5,000 live in 20 small towns north of Eilat, the largest of which is Yatvada, with a population of 610. The Israeli residents of the region are mostly Jewish. See also Arava Institute for Environmental Studies, Academic Program in Israel Nahal Harava, a wadi in the northern part of the Arava Negev Sands of Samar, an expanse of sand dunes in the southern Arava Southern District Israel. Wadi Araba Crossing, southernmost border crossing between Jordan and Israel <laughs>